In the heart of the Middle East, a city known for its sun-soaked landscapes and towering skyscrapers suddenly found itself battling an adversary of a different kind, an adversary that fell from the sky. Dubai, an oasis in the desert, was transformed into a city of rivers. In just 12 hours, a year's worth of rain had descended upon the city, turning roads into waterways and leaving the bustling Dubai International Airport submerged. This was no ordinary rainfall. This was an unprecedented flash flood, a torrential downpour that caused chaos throughout the city. Flights were canceled, check-ins suspended, and passengers left stranded as infrastructure struggled to keep up with the relentless deluge. The storm system was so extreme, it impacted neighboring countries, painting a somber picture of the power of nature unleashed. But what was the catalyst behind this extreme weather event? Climate change. As our planet warms, the likelihood of extreme weather events increases. The flood in Dubai serves as a stark reminder of this reality, a reality we cannot afford to ignore. The aftermath of the storm was not pretty. The city, known for its resilience, was left grappling with the effects of the flood. As the rain eased, residual showers were expected before dry conditions returned. But the scars left by the flood were not so easily erased. In this report, we have explored the recent flash floods in Dubai, the chaos they caused, and the role climate change played in exacerbating the event. We've delved into the aftermath and the challenges the city faced in the wake of such an extreme weather event. It's a stark reminder of the unpredictable and destructive nature of our changing climate and a call to action for us all. As we conclude, let's remember that climate change isn't just a future threat. It's happening here and now. Its effects are real and they're escalating. The Dubai flood is a testament to that. It's a wake-up call to the world, a signal that we need to act and act now to mitigate the impacts of our changing climate.